How to become a successful amateur photographer. Do you have a high-end DSLR or do you have a basic point-and-shoot camera? In reality, it doesn't make any difference. Being a good amateur has nothing to do with the camera. Taking great photos has nothing to do with the camera. Taking great shots is all about the photographer. Let's say you do have a great camera but you have no idea how to take a good picture. The end result is going to be a poor quality image. All is not lost though. What you simply need to do is learn how to take good shots and the way you do that is by making a few adjustments to your technique. Over time taking great photos will become easy. Tip number one, getting the feeling of warmth. Have you ever noticed that your photos look kind of clammy? If you were to check your white balance you'll notice the setting is on the default setting auto. Auto works fine if all you want are a few snapshots. If your goal is to get a warmer sharper look and feel Set your white balance to the cloudy setting. The cloudy setting enhances yellows and reds. This adds a richer, warmer look to your shots. Tip number two, add a polarizing filter. This filter will drastically reduce the unwanted reflections and glare on your images. This works well if you like taking outdoor or landscape shots. Using a polarizer adds richer colors to the shots. If you have a simple point and shoot camera that does not allow filters to be added, take a pair of sunglasses and place them in front of the lens. The end result will be similar to a polarizer. Make sure you cannot see the rims of the glasses and be sure to place the glasses as close to the lens as possible. And tip number three, if you want a shiny outdoor shot, be sure to use the camera fill or camera flash feature. This gives you flash control instead of the camera having flash control. What you're doing is revealing the background of the image then adding the flash to enhance the subject. I provide you with three tips to help you become a better photographer. There are many more things you can do to enhance your skills. I suggest you have a few classes at your local college or trade school. Doing this will help you do in the development of becoming a great amateur photographer.